I was in my local hardware store today and I ran across these RCA connectors that actually look like they're pretty good. And these um, remind me of Shakespeare center pin connectors and in fact they say award winning center pin technology. So even though they say RCA on them, uh, these are probably uh, made by um, Shakespeare. Uh, that would be my guess. Well, there's two kinds. There are um, these are both for RG6. Uh, this is a um, F connector, and this one is a splice, inline splice for two pieces of cable. Now, typically, I don't like to um, splice cable anywhere when possible, but if you got to do it, I would rather do it with these than I would with uh, you know the cheap. Uh, barrel connector with standard, uh, you know, standard connectors. Well, I removed one of these from the package. Um, and these were both about six dollars. So six dollars for this, and six dollars for two of these connectors. And the connectors, and, and it looks like they give you a couple extra O-rings. Um, the connectors are three pieces. Uh, there's the, basically the body, uh, and then the end cap and then also an o-ring. Now the way these work is you really don't have to monkey around with um, doing any cutting and trimming back of the wires or anything. All you need to do is to cut the wire off straight. So basically just like this you just cut the wire straight and then what you have to do is where this is de deformed a little bit take a pair of pliers and just kind of round it a little bit to bring it kind of back into shape like that. Well then the next step, and this is so simple, um, you put the sleeve, or, or I guess you, I don't know what they call this, the, uh, the, the end cap over the cable, and then you put the o-ring over like so, and then this, you basically is turn it up to four turns as you push it in until it seats. And they even recommend actually pulling it off to make sure that it's seated and you can tell that it's seated so we'll put that back on. Then basically all you need to do is take a pair of pliers and crimp the opposing uh, tines and there's six of them. Basically you just crimp the, the opposing tines two at a time like this and you go around. Now what you want to do is you have to actually do this step more than what you might think because these tines are what goes into the shield and unfortunately I've found about a 50% failure rate with doing this unless you pay attention and really crimp down on these good. Then what you do is you take the, which kind of tells you that this is a one-time shot. Then you take the O-ring and run the O-ring over like so. And then the end cap goes in here. And then it just tightens down like, like that. And if you have them tight enough, or I should say if you've squeezed those tines enough, this end cap should screw on fairly easily. If it and if it's kind of difficult to screw on, then you probably don't have them tight enough. And again, we're just going to measure again, just to make sure that we got good connectivity uh, in the shield. So there you have it. That's all there is to it. Uh, you know, these are very high quality. Um, and again, I I'm very familiar with these with the center pin technology for because um, it's been around for a few years for uh, boating. VHF FM uh, radios, uh, and I've used those to great success. Uh, and I, this is the first I've seen them for CATV or for television use. So, anyway, if you find these, uh, give them a shot. Uh, I don't know if you can uh, find them on Amazon or anything. I'll, I'll take and look for them, but and if I do, I'll post them on my website. But if not, uh, you can do an internet search 
and the um, connector in a package of two, the part number is DT60 CFR, and the feet or the barrel connector is DT60 CFTR. You can also probably search on center pin and RG6 or center pin F connector, you know, any anything like that, and you probably will find them. So, um, hopefully, you found this uh, neat product uh, informative, and and actually, I think they really work better than uh, the uh, standard push-on or crimp-on. And one thing's for sure, they do look nicer.